T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 3, 2, 1, 0, and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis on a mission to build, resupply, and to do research on the International Space Station. Houston now controlling. Atlantis begins its penultimate journey to shore up the International Space Station. Atlantis now on the proper... 10. DLS is go for main engine start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And booster ignition and liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery. Taking the space station to full power for full science. This is Mission Control Houston. Discovery roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. Discovery's roll maneuver is complete. It is now in a heads-down position on track for its flight to the International Space Station. Discovery flying 365 miles per hour, one and a half, one and a half miles in altitude, seven miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. Discovery's engines are... One minute now to touchdown. Discovery's landing gear will be locked down and into place at 300 feet in altitude. It's currently 3,500 3, feet and uh, traveling at a rate of 370 miles per hour. Thirty seconds until touchdown. Main gear touchdown, pilot 
Jim Dutton now deploying the drag chute. Nose gear touchdown. That brings an end to the STS-131 mission, the 131st Space Shuttle flight, and the 33rd to the International Space Station. Discovery left Florida on April 5th with 7.6 tons of new science equipment and spare parts, including equipment that should improve the station's capability for Earth observation work, equipment that could help astronauts avoid muscle atrophy, and scientists better understand muscle atrophy, and equipment that will help keep the station systems cooling properly.